Hey everybody, just wanted to do a uh, follow-up video here for you guys. Some guys have been asking for some sound clips with it starting and uh, with the truck starting up cold and um, some more driving. So here we are today. It's a chilly day in January. It's 37 degrees right now. Um, haven't driven the truck here all day. Just now taking it down here to town. Um, but we are at our 10,000 mile mark so it's been 10,000 miles since we did the compounds on the, on the truck here um, so far so good everything's still running good no problems no uh, codes no issues yet um, fuel mileage still been pretty consistent I would say about two mile a gallon better than it was before we did the compounds uh, yeah so nothing else has really um, changed on the truck since I did the compounds on it. Uh, the only thing I'll show in the video here, I did do a, um, it's called a BD pressure enhancer uh, for the transmission just to help it shift a little quicker and put more pressure to the clutches. So um, it seemed to make a pretty big difference, especially if you're ripping around on the truck a little bit uh, from third well, pretty much from lockup. So from third gear lockup up through to uh, sixth gear, definitely made fifth and sixth shift a lot crisper and quicker than um, even stock. It was terrible. You know how these things just drag out the gears. Uh, so we're gonna go down here. I might do a little pull on to the interstate just to show you how it runs here. But so far so good. So this would be my upgrade on the pressure controller. This is a 6R140 pressure controller from BD. And the way this works, your stock um, line pressure in the transmission would be around 170 PSI. So with these controllers, once you hit uh, 10 pounds of boost, it'll crank your pressure up to 300 PSI. So you got two wires here, two plugs. One goes down and pigs into the um, connector to the transmission. The other wire I ran underneath here and actually can't really see it here, but it would pigtail into your map sensor, which that's how it would pick up your, uh, your boost. So once it sees 10 pounds of boost coming out of that map sensor, then it would kick the controller on and crank your pressure up. had the transmission uh, serviced as well in this thing. I, at 100,000 miles, I like to go pretty much bumper to bumper with all the fluids. Um, so we did axles, uh, transmission transfer case, coolant, power steering fluid, uh, serpentine belt, pretty much everything at that 100,000 mile mark that way. I know I'm good for the next 100,000 miles without um, doing anything outside of pretty much oil changes um, and fuel filters. But when we did the transmission, the oil looked perfect. So at 10,000 miles of running this setup on a stock transmission, it does not seem to care. That was about three quarters throttle, something like that. Just to merge onto the interstate here. I cannot get over the EGTs in this thing, exhaust temps. Um, big, big number on my monitor here. If it'll focus in, you know, cruising down the interstate 75 mile an hour. We're at six, 600 degrees, I'll say. Um, you know, that's just crazy to me. 
considering my Cummins would sit here and run at eight, 900 degrees on the interstate. At this kind of speed, you know, about 1800 RPMs at 70 mile an hour, something like that. Uh, definitely lights this turbo like nothing. If you hit a hill or just wanna want to um, take off in traffic, it'll go. Yeah, so that's that's where we're at here. Um, as I put some more miles on it, I might do another follow-up video at 20 to 30,000 miles into this setup. I'll see how it's holding up by then. I'm gonna be doing a lot of heavy towing here about the middle of the end of February. Uh, a lot of loads, 10 to 15,000 pound loads. So that'll really put it to the test here and see see how the transmission holds up, how well the compounds work for towing I know it's gonna it's gonna tow really nice uh, it's just got a crazy low-end power um, so yeah if there's anything else you guys would like to see just let me know and um, I'll try to get a video and, and post it up thanks for watching